Hey guys, this is going to be a get ready with me on how I'm able to slay with natural hair and wearing little to no makeup, so let's go ahead and just get started. Starting off with a fresh face, I'm going to show you guys my skincare routine because you guys ask me every single day of my life. <laughs> so I'm using these off brand like baby wipes that my daughter's daycare gave us and I'm just going to use that to clean my face. I haven't washed my face with a washcloth since my daughter was born, like I've just been using baby wipes. After I do that, my face is nice and smooth. So. To moisturize it, I use any lotion I have lying around and I'm just using my favorite right now which is the Athena Active Naturals and it smells like pomegranate so that's my favorite right now. Using my MAC Studio Perfect Brows Palette that I got from TJ Maxx, I'm going to first use my spoolie to brush my brows in place, and then using my small little brow brush, I'm going to dip it in the brown color and start my eyebrows off by lining it at the bottom. And I just like to line the bottom near the front. I do not fill in the front of my brows because you do not want your freaking eyebrows looking like a block. So yeah, I just line the bottom of my brows as best as I can. And it's best to do this when your eyebrows are nice and clean and trimmed, you know, so pluck all those ugly hairs away. And then pretty much after that, I'm just filling it in to my liking. I also wanted to mention I don't line the top of my eyebrows because I don't know I just feel like it makes it look a bit more natural when it's not completely freaking boxy. Once I'm finished with my eyebrows, I take my Maybelline New York Fit Me Concealer in the number 25 beige and I just begin by lining my eyebrows so they can be nice and perfect and neat and when I'm doing this, I'm like in freaking stone, like I'm not even blinking, my hand is as steady as it can be because I'm like OCD with my eyebrow line. If it is not perfect and straight, I like, I'll just cry, like literally. So so you just want to make sure it's perfect and straight so that it looks nice, crisp, and clean. Now, any normal person would probably blend the concealer in with a brush, but I don't wear makeup so I don't have makeup brushes. So I just use a Q-tip and pretty much wipe the concealer off. Um, and yeah, sometimes I do leave a little bit just so that it has a nice little outline, but just be aware that this concealer, like, you have to wipe it off as much as you can because it will show when you, like, take pictures. It's so annoying, so you gotta kind of, like, blend it in as best as you can. And then I'm just going to start with my eyelashes. I've just bought this new Too Faced Better Than Sex <laughs> Mascara. Sorry, my daughter. <laughs> And yeah, um, I already put one coat of mascara on. As you can see, it looks so good. But right now, I'm adding a second coat. I like to, I like my eyelashes to be bold. And I'm just showing you up top some other lash uh, mascara I like to use. I'll link it down below. Those are my top three favorites. So as you can see, the big difference. I love it so much. Um, so yeah, I like to start my mascara by pretty much putting the mascara on the tips of my lashes and I feel like this makes it longer um, so that's how I like to start and then I will begin by building it and you know putting the mascara on the rest of my lashes and for this side I put three coats instead of two because I don't know why you'll be able to notice this side of my lashes is a little bit shorter than the other side and it's super annoying so I try my best to make it as long as I can I don't always do my bottom lashes, but I was trying to be really cute this time, so I did my bottom lashes, and then you're gonna see me just cleaning up under them because I don't like it to look like super, I don't know, you'll just see. Once 
once I'm all done with my makeup, this is what my hair is looking like once I take it down. This was a three strand twist out, you guys, and it was my first time doing it. It turned out so good. It was super defined. So if you haven't seen that tutorial, I'll go ahead and put that down below. I wish my daughter would stop making noises, but it's okay. Um, and yeah, that is the end of this tutorial. I pretty much just wanted to show you that, you know, you can still be... I don't know, you can still be like that Instagram baddie. You can still slay when you are wearing your natural hair and you wear little to no makeup because that is pretty much what I do every day of my life. Here is just a close up of my eyebrows and my lashes. Everyone on Instagram always asks me, Where is your eyebrow tutorial? Where is your eyebrow tutorial? So. Here it is, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little get ready with me. I know it's not like the fanciest, but this is just what I do every day. So go ahead, give me a thumbs up, comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Bye.